Hey everyone and welcome to the channel, my name is Ash and today I'm doing a review for Mission 1985 on the Nintendo Switch. Now this came out in October 2022 and it's published by Consolog and it harks back to the sort of classic uh, run and gun shooter arcade games of the 80s. Now in this game you work your way through a variety of levels to defeat General Hector. There are 11 levels to play through and through nine of them they take place in this sort of 2D sort of scrolling shooter action where you sort of progress vertically etc up through these levels avoiding being killed and basically blasting away any enemy in front of you. Then in the other two levels, which is a really nice little um, sort of flip of the gameplay, it ends up in a sort of 3D space Harrier style viewpoint where you sort of drive in um, a vehicle. And yeah, it's really cool. It looks fantastic. While it obviously is heavily inspired by games from the 1980s, especially how it plays and its sort of overall aesthetic. It does have a modern coat of paint and it runs fantastically well. Now in the single player mode, um, it is a very difficult game. It, it, it's one of those games that would cost me all my pocket money as a kid. I'd be putting money and money and money into it in the arcades. Luckily I don't have to keep doing that um, as it's on Switch. Now it does also have a co-op mode as well which does make it easier and is a lot of fun playing with a friend. As you're progressing through the sort of 2D levels you fight a variety of enemies, all different types of soldiers, you'll come across different types of um, sort of weaponry as well so you can pick up a variety of guns you basically have your standard sort of rifle when you start but you can pick up things like uh, machine guns so they fire in sort of bursts you get um flamethrowers which are my favorite because you can literally just set people on fire um and also you get tons of grenades now one thing i do like is the sort of the gore so like when you set people on fire they absolutely burn and everything and when you shoot them the blood squirts out everywhere obviously some people won't enjoy that but i thought it looked fantastic and i was like haha this is a this is good i enjoyed this now to get extra health if you do take damage you save soldiers that are tied up throughout the levels everyone you save you get another life now there's obviously foot soldiers to avoid but there's also things like tanks and helicopters camel riding soldiers all this sort of cool silly stuff flying past you um coming at you sort of on mass that you've got to avoid as well as traps um falling down holes mines and then obviously later on lava stuff like that and there are bosses at the end of the levels as well which can be pretty hard but like i say if you've ever played like an old school arcade game you'll know what to do now this game is eight pound and 99 pence um it's currently on sale for another week at 50 percent off at four pound and 49 pence so definitely recommend picking it up if you're interested in it the fact that it has got that co-op local play is great um like i say it'll take you quite a while to get through depending on your skill level because it is exceptionally hard it did take me multiple multiple runs just to get through the first level alone um, just sort of memorizing where troops are coming from and enemies and stuff and making sure i had the right guns and the, uh, enough like grenades at the right time to blow up the jeeps and the tanks when they were coming at me but it's simple but really addictively fun to play and they've done a great job with the sound and the graphics on this one so it's available right now check it out and if you've enjoyed this video please hit like and subscribe you are on the way to 1000 subscribers and let us know in the comments if there's any more games like this you want to see us play because i love retro games but i also love retro inspired modern games stuff like this that while it's brand new, it feels and plays like an old school arcade game. Can't go wrong with it. But that's that for this video, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, hit that like button, hit subscribe, and we will see you soon for more comments. Bye for now.